Welcome back, folks. My thing. We're still in the Tower of the Gods, believe it or not. Yes, because it's super fun. Do you like the Tower of the Gods? Because I do. It's my second favourite dungeon. Can you have a favourite dungeon? Is that not paradoxical? Oh well. So yeah, I needed to go into that other room to get the key. Which was actually pretty annoying. Oh well. So yeah, those giant Armos kind of things were Armos Knights. Basically, you won't need to fight them because they're so slow and you'll probably fight... I'll show you. You'll probably fight one in the next couple of segment video things anyway. Okay, here we have lasers. The coolest thing in the game. Online, not really. Climb up onto this pedestal thing. Uh, I forget. Oh, yeah. Fly across. Just barely making it. Cool. Yes, another statue. Yes, there's another statue controller segment. We're not part of the game, so we're gonna do. Uh, you know, do 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 do. Hooray! Okay, now we can control this dude. He can walk through lasers. Pretty cool. You're gonna want him to stand on that. Then return. Guys, link. Pick him up. And exit. Because it's really that easy. Now comes the hard part. Oh, he can Oh my god. Okay, these are wizard robes. Uh, they're magicians, they teleport around the room and shoot fire at you. Fortunately, they're not that hard. They get harder as you go along, but hey ho. Okay, what you're going to want to do is you're going to shove this guy onto one of these, lift it up. How do you want to go now? What you want to do is try to get the one he's standing on to go to the top. By doing that, you have to balance it out with our motors. Throw. Fail. Okay, one. Because. Yeah, you want to put as many as you can on because. You have to stand on there as well, and you count as one armor's thing. Hey, nice throw. So I think we can stand on it now. Yes, we can. Oh. <laughs> I have this horrible, terrible feeling yep. that you're all yelling out. Huh? You have to jump with it, not throw it over. Oh my god, that was terrible. I'm so sorry. <sighs> Wasn't that great? Wasn't that so worth a minute and a half of video time? Because no, no, it wasn't. It was absolutely terrible. So terrible. So I was like, whoa, everything's got a whole lot more pink. It's not pink, it's lightish red. Up, up, and away. the next part of the dungeon which I shall be doing. Okay right, these be most things. I think you can take them out with one hit. Yes, they were activated. Boom. One. Be most. Wait a second. There's the key. So what do we have to do? Ouch. Ouch. Arrows for the win. Grab this thing. 
yet more statue fun. Who doesn't like statues? Me, that's it. I hate statues. In real life too. They're just awful. And what, you know, those people who pretend to be statues? I don't get the point in that. Why don't you just get a real statue and you don't have to pay it? Yeah, I don't know how they stave off blink it, blinking for like the whole day while they get money. You know, I was in France on my summer holidays and you saw loads of them. Oh boy, then they all come to life. Okay, then there's that. Oh, I'm not going to screen ignore. Oh, you have to beat them. Fine. Oh, yeah, two is one stone. That doesn't even make sense. Okay, let's then beat. And you go into the drop hearts, that would be really convenient. Hearts? No, not for you guys. Can you give me some hearts, Mr. Pot? Fine then, Mr. Pot. See if I care. Okay. You think it would be dark outside, but it's not. It's just a long final push up to the boss. Okay, these are blue beamers. What they do is they don't follow you. That's all that's really interesting about them. You still take a one hit kill. That's a red one, you can just roll by that one. The blue ones you can't roll by, unfortunately. Uh, these curl drops can be taken out with one arrow. And they drop golden feathers more often than not. Two red beamers. Okay. Alrighty then, folks. In the next video, we're gonna go fight the boss. See you then.